you're going to get to see this thing that I'm recording for you. That's not in my hands, that's in the hands of my boss. I call him my boss, he's my editor, and it depends on when he decides to put it out to you for you to see. But uh, good old Joey, hello. Um, but um, I have to tell you that I woke up this morning, and I'm telling you this on Tuesday morning. I woke up laughing. <laughs> and if you're a Chelsea fan, if you can't cry, then you can only laugh. I woke up laughing, heavily laughing. I was in stitches. You want to know why? We just signed another player. <laughs> we just signed another player. I can't wait for August the 31st to come and go when the transfer window will be shut because every day you wake up, there's a new player coming into Chelsea. It's amazing. We've just signed another player. We've got 43 players on our books at the moment. Okay, we're getting rid of one, but we're getting rid of one from 43, but we're getting another one in. And they still talk about another one coming through at some point. We're signing another player. Where are all these players going in the training ground? What is poor old Enzo Mereska doing with so many players? Let me give you a little test here. Did you know that Chelsea has six first-team goalkeepers? Did you hear me? Six first-team goalkeepers. I say I shouldn't laugh. Six first-team goalkeepers. <laughs> That's crazy. Championship teams, we, we always say there's a rule in coaching and, and in the football world. If you want to win titles, you've got to have two players for each position because of eventualities and injuries. Two players per position. We've got six for the goalkeeping position alone. I don't know where any of them is going to go. I don't know what's happening with Kepa, Bergstrom. And we signed two or three new ones in addition to the ones that we've already got at Chelsea. Six goalkeepers, 43 players in total. It's carnage. It's chaotic. It's mad. And we're still signing. And we're still signing. And everybody that can play football that is associated with football is being linked to another big name, big money signing at Chelsea Football Club. It's a joke, an absolute joke. Yet, we still got pummeled by Manchester City at the opening game of the season. It wasn't like if any of these new signings came and made the team better. And we're still where we are. And I'm wondering when is it going to stop? But you know what? Now here's the thing, we still love Chelsea. I'm not talking about you. I know you're a hater, or you. Some of us still love Chelsea. We still love the badge, we still love the club. And at some point, we're hoping that the owners, chaotic, 1.2, 1.3 billion pounds later on, will come at some stage and say to our faces, look us in the eye and say, See, we told you it was going to work out. Here's some trophies for you. Not looking like it at the moment. Absolute chaos. But we're hopeful. We're prayerful that that day will come when the owner will come and tell us I'm justified in the money that I spent on this club. Gosh. 40-odd players. Six goalkeepers. What are your thoughts? Please drop your comments. Uh, let me know what you think. No insults. Don't have a go at me. I'm not Chelsea. I love Chelsea, but I didn't create the club. And I didn't create the chaos. But drop your comments. Let's hear it. Subscribe to me. Follow me. Like what I'm saying. And I'll be back again. Hopefully, to come and tell you how much less than 43 the players in Chelsea are by the turn of the month when the transfer window is over. Until then, keep your chins blue, 
Lankayam. See you.